Experts say Americans are surprised by the royal family's representation of class. Royal writer Sarah Lyle answers the age-old question, why do people love the royal family so much? The royal family, is so complicated it's like watching a reality TV series, says a royal expert. Welcome to Royal Updates. If you're new here, please don't forget to subscribe to our channel, so you don't miss any updates about the British monarchy. The Daily Express US spoke to New York Times columnist Sarah Lyle about why, who said people are fascinated by the royal family for different reasons. Ms. Lyle worked as the American newspaper's London correspondent from 1995 to 2013. Only last year, she wrote the original audiobook on Royal, Three Women Who Shook Up the Monarchy, so she has a good handle on the subject. When I talked to the author about public perception, she divided it into two parts, how the royal family is viewed in the United Kingdom and the United States. In the United Kingdom, the royals were always part of the system, and in the United States, Americans were fascinated by the ancient nature of the British class system. Because the knights are American, they say, to our latent pride, and our latent fascination with a system, that we fought a revolution to get away from. Lyle explains the differences between the British and American public's relationships with the royal family, in the United Kingdom, the royals are part of the fabric of society, and in the United States, the royals are part of American history. In the United Kingdom, as long as there has been a monarchy, there have been people wondering whether it should exist or not, wondering how much money should be allocated to it, wondering what the role of the monarch is etc., etc., says the royal author. She adds, in the US, it's a bit different, because we're supposed to be a classless society, which of course isn't true, but we're supposed to be. But we're quite fascinated by the archaic nature of the British class system. She uses popular culture as an example, saying, I think it explains why we're so fascinated by Upstairs and Down Tears and Downton Abbey, and all these other shows that focus on the upper class and their relationship with the lower class. I think this structure is very amazingly represented, she adds. Lyle goes further, explaining why it is so attractive to the viewer, it plays into our latent arrogance, our latent fascination with a system that we fought a revolution to get away from. The royal author points out that royal observers are a couple of steps ahead, which adds to the mystery, but at the same time, it's low stakes and something everyone can have an opinion on as an observer. I also feel like, in this very difficult moment that the world is going through right now, and I found this when Prince Harry and Meghan Markle did their interview, why do people care so much? She points out. On one level, people care, because Harry and Meghan have been speaking to the public through an interview with Orba Winfrey, saying things that royals wouldn't normally say, and talking about private matters, which has led to a family rift. Lyle talks about royal surveillance, as if it were a club, and everyone is involved.